NASA discovers mysterious looking iceberg in Antarctica. It really is quite the sight to behold and could even be called a phenomenon. Let's find out more, shall we? NASA has discovered some strange and amazing things in this world. I mean, their latest being this gigantic, perfect table iceberg floating away in Antarctica, for instance. This huge monolithic iceberg is reported to be 5,800 square kilometers floating just off the east coast of the Antarctic Peninsula. This is from yesterday's hashtag Icebridge flight. A tabular iceberg can be seen on the right, floating among sea ice just off of the Larsen Sea Ice Shelf. The iceberg's sharp angles and flat surface indicates that it probably recently calved from the ice shelf. This is near the Larsen Sea Ice Shelf as stated before, where NASA believes the iceberg has recently broken off from. Evidence of a recent break comes from the fact that the iceberg has sharp edges. The block of ice is suspiciously perfect for something that's fallen off an ice shelf. But in an interview with Live Science, an ice scientist with NASA and at the University of Maryland, Kelly Brunt, said the berg was formed from a process that's apparently fairly common. She was quoted as saying, So here's the deal. We get two types of icebergs. We get the type that everyone can envision in their head that sank the Titanic, and they look like prisms or triangles at the surface, and you know they have a crazy subsurface. And then you have what are called tabular icebergs. Brunt added that even the scientists thought the find was unusual, as it's almost like a square. She went on to advise people not to walk on the sheet, as though it probably wouldn't flip over. Its exact mass is unknown and probably hidden in the water, and it may crack and break, making it pretty dangerous. New photos released by Icebridge scientists also reveal that the iceberg isn't actually a perfect rectangle, but very angular quadrilateral. The photos were taken by Icebridge senior support scientist Jeremy Harbeck. I thought it was pretty interesting, said Harbeck in a NASA statement. I often see icebergs with relatively straight edges, but I have not really seen one before with two corners at such right angles like this one had. He also added, I was actually more interested in capturing the A68 iceberg that we were about to fly over, but I thought this rectangular iceberg was visually interesting and fairly photogenic. So on a lark, I just took a couple photos. NASA has kept a close watch on the Larsen Sea ice shelf after a massive iceberg broke free from it and began to spin. Experts have gone on record and said if all of the Larsen Sea was to break free, it could add another 4 inches or 10 centimeters to global sea levels over the years. However, the breakage may not be down to climate change. With all that said and done, that was our video for today, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, why not click on the subscribe button and maybe also hit one of the two videos up above.